The Circle Stone Ruins are Arizona's version of Stonehenge. Located in the Superstition Wilderness, they're a great single night, overnight backpack. The Circle Stone Ruins are a circular ring of rocks that are located atop one of the highest peaks in the Superstition Wilderness. From this view from Google Earth, you can clearly see the rocks that still exist there today. This diagram, made by the Mesa Community College GIS Mapping Project, clearly shows the astronomical uh, alignments of the various features of this ruin. This site and the surrounding Superstition Wilderness are located just north east of Phoenix, Arizona. You can reach them from several different trailheads, but I use the Rogers Trough Trailhead. This graphic shows the GPS track that I created while doing this hike. And uh, there's pretty substantial elevation, there's about uh, 2,200 feet of uh, ascent, and of course the same descent as you're leaving, over roughly nine and a half miles of hiking. We begin our trip at the Rogers Trough Trailhead, which is uh, located a short drive from the Florence Junction intersection of Highway 60 and Highway 79. One of the nice things about this hike is there is water at Rivas Ranch, so make sure once you get to the ranch that you replenish your water supplies. There's no water after Rivas Ranch, so make sure you have enough to get you to uh, return to this point where you can recharge on the way down. Just before you get to Rivas Ranch itself, right after you cross Rivas Creek, you'll come to the Fireline Trail number 118. This junction is well signed. From here, you make a right and start rapidly climbing uphill. It's a pretty little spot, just about 10 minutes west of the uh, Circle Stone Cutoff. Nice rock promontory there. And you can see what the, uh, what the trail looks like along here. Because this is the Fireline Trail, it's got nice wide fire breaks in it. Well, I was worried that the Circle Stone Ruins turn off wouldn't be easy to find, but it looks pretty well cairned. And that's the trail going up the ridge line right there. No sign, but at least there's a cairn and a faint trail. Okay, I'm trying the Circle Stone. Pretty substantial. So make your way through here. Some of these walls, hard to say which ones have been reconstructed. This is uh, center area, and it looks like there was a little, little dwelling in here. Now pretty much grown over and it has a nice collection of beautiful Hedgecock cactus that are about to bloom. Look at that. That's gorgeous. I chose to do this hike on a night where there was a full moon to get the full effect. Unfortunately it was a little bit overcast but that gave me some great sunset views from the top of the mountain. The views up at the top here are absolutely spectacular. You have a 360 degree view of the superstition wilderness around you. The sun's setting here at the campsite. Kind of cool. Backlit Hennessy Hammock. Here's the Circle Stone Ruins as the sun sets. top of this mountain is also one of the few spots where you can actually see the city lights of Phoenix down below you at night. This is really a unique view in the superstitions. This is a beautiful hike down from the Circle Stone Ruins this morning. Coming down into the Rivas Ranch area below me here. And the, uh, it's a nice trail. Rocky. But uh, nice easy grade, at this section anyway. And it's a beautiful morning here in the Superstition Wilderness. 
I did this hike towards the end of April when there were lots of wildflowers in boom, but the wild lupine were in particular quite spectacular on this hike. I hope you learned something from this video and that you will come to the Superstition Wilderness and enjoy the Circle Stone Ruins as much as I did. Oh, 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 o